among starfishes in the world, the crown of thorns is the only starfish that is poisonous. Its entire body barring the underside is covered with spines which are venomous. Whenever the crown of thorns stains a person using these spines, it releases venom that causes intense pain. Red surgeon fish essentially is a reef fish related to cichlids. They attack with their tail which has spines at its base. These spines remain dormant within the tail until the fish that there is no danger. Whenever aggravated the surgeon fish stick out their spines that are like small knives. These highly poisonous spines can even cause death by hypovolemia. The other symptoms are hypertension. Although the puffer fish is highly poisonous, it is unable to inject its poison on other creatures. Actually the danger lies in the eating of the fish. Tetrodotoxin, a potent toxin is found in the liver, intestines, skin and ovaries of the fish, leaving only the muscle tissue that is somewhat safe to eat. In spite of its inherent poison, the puffer fish is a delicacy in countries like Japan and only certified and highly experienced chefs are permitted to set up this scary fish. Scorpion fish belongs to the family of scorpionid that includes stonefish and lionfish. This prickly fish carries its poison in its fins. A sting of the scorpion fish results in extreme pain is also swelling, which can spread to a whole leg or arm within a matter of minutes. Scorpion is found mainly in tropical seas that included the warm shores of coastal United States. They are found worldwide as a highly po- The box fish resembles the puffer fish closely. If threatened by larger fishes or divers, it injects a fatal toxin that poisons the whole of its vicinity. Thus other target victim and other nearby creatures are also caught up in the torment. The poison destroys both the red blood cells as also the respiratory. Stingray is an aggressive fish that whips out its venomous tail in an elegant arc, the same way a scorpion stings. The forward half of its tail can have a maximum of seven spines that this potent fish uses to impose an excruciating and venomous sting to an aggressor. The spine if breaks off during an attack might get lodged in the body of the victim resulting in extreme bleeding as also infection. The stingray venom causes unbearable pain, muscle cramps, swelling, heart. The fourth of the top ten most poisonous fishes in the world, the viper fish is a toothy creature. This is one of the most poisonous inhabitants of the deep. Its curving fangs reaches up to its mouth as well as eyes. It possesses an organ named the light-producing organ which he utilizes to lure its prey. It stays motionless when a victim approaches and with its rather long body surrounds the bigger victims. Fortunately, the viper fish isn't interested in The lionfish is considered a highly toxic fish. The venom is present in the dorsal spines and these are used only a defensive measure. Actually, it's a timid and non-aggressive fish, and envenomation happens just because some creature comes in contact with its spine. The poison gives rise to severe pain, headache, vomiting, part of breathing, paralysis of every muscle in the body that includes the cardiac muscle, resulting in... The stonefish is by far a storehouse of venom. It has virulent potent venom stored in its glands, at the bottom of its 13-needle-shaped dorsal fin spines. Most victims injure themselves as they touch or step on it accidentally. The pain is so unbearable that some victims of its potent sting demands that the affected limb should be amputated. The venom can also cause shock, temporary paralysis, and... Here is the biggie. We have Vandalia cirrhosis, the most poisonous fishes in the world. Don't go with its appearance, it can harm you very badly. This fish is from South America and normally found in water streams. It's a fish all covered with sharp little thorns. The main quality it is having is the power of being attracted to blood and urine. It can easily locate the host from the blood and then expands the spines on its target and starts sucking the blood from the victim. There is a huge fear among people that the Vandalia can swim into vagina, even penis or even deeper sometimes. Then it does the same thing, expands its spines and starts sucking blood. Then it yeah.